There's a saying here in Gotham. It was adopted from the Miyagani tribe who lived here long ago, before they were all murdered. <laughs> it goes, happiness is seeing the world through the eyes of children. There's even a Latin version on our subway token. Through new eyes. There's truth in it, though. I've never told anyone this, but whenever I have a bad night, whenever I doubt myself or my mission as Batman, like now, <laughs> I try to see things through my children's eyes. Dick, Dick was the first Robin. He had the happiest eyes, circus eyes, you know, weightless, <laughs> leaping. Never falling, but it's true of all of them. So remind yourself, Bruce, now, quickly. Feel it, feel the joy, the peace <laughs> it brings. To look into your child's eyes, see the world as they see it. What have you done? What I had to. What are you? Take the damned thing off right now! Let me see your bloody... <sighs> eyes. My God. Alfred. <laughs> do not do <laughs> that again. You're... You're not Bruce anymore. Give me the visor. No! Every monster you face, you've always won by remaining true to who you are. My boy, Bruce Wayne. This... I won't let you... Alfred, listen to me very carefully. The Batman who laughs. The way his eyes work, he sees through the membrane to the dark multiverse. He sees all the things people fear, desire, their urges. His visor is made of dark metal. It lets him filter out the dark energy, the noise, focus in to see what he wants <laughs> to see. <laughs> I forged the visor in your hands from the dark metal we stripped from Gotham. It's attuned to the same energy as his. If I can learn to use it, I might be able to predict where the next Bruce Wayne is coming through and beat him at his own game. <laughs> Please. I'll take it from you if I have to. You try. Damn it, get no! No! You hit me. <laughs> Bruce, I. I'm so sorry, I. <laughs>